Hello and welcome as it is that of Wednesday, the 25th day of July 2018. This is your crypto day morning. My name is Derek. Like always, all trades, all risks, all wagers are that of your own risk, own reward. Failed move, fast moves when markets are ready to go. Oh boy, do they ever. Looking at Vercoin last night in the late hours, late hours Eastern time zone. What uh, happened afterwards? Oh, baby, when markets go, ah, they go. The amount that it got back within this move, while well, it managed to get up to a key Fibonacci level at 25,000. And after consistent decline from this level on May 15th, down to that of June 29th, it went sideways for a while. And then, like this game works, Breaks down below this level of support and failed breakdown lower brought, well, the big move towards the upside. And when it left this Fibonacci level, pretty much around May the 20th, it took, and that's not even to these lows, it took month and change just to get down to these 12,000 lows, let alone from the time of this bottom. It only took a few hours to get several weeks, multiple, two handfuls of weeks back. That's the way the crypto game works. You're not gonna get polar opposites where it grinds its way up for 50 days. And then everything that it gained in 50 days, it gives back in a couple or that of three, or in a case like this, hours. That's the way these crypto markets go. Meanwhile, that of the Bitcoin charts, it's uh, it's doing well, hanging in there. It had an amazing up day yesterday. So it had the one leg higher from the 61 up to about 74. Some sideways action, two days up. And whether it's stopping the elevator ride higher, well, we can see on the hourly time frame, continuously moving up, it has yet to show it's going to correct sideways through time because that's usually what the market does when it stops going up it just goes sideways maybe it will price action has on the single hour time frame gone through the 18 average 18 average starting to decline showing possibilities of momentum fading away uh, possibilities to fill some of these uh, lower ends but in a spot like this if you just adjust your time frame to something like the three hour you're gonna see how it's still just starting to support such an event with the 18 average of lows currently coming in at uh, 8,100 at this time. So it's had a, a good gain and I'm very confident with the Bitcoin news information and the historical volatility that Bitcoin has that some interesting times are going to be uh, brewing up over the next little while as we move into the uh, second half of this northern hemisphere summer it's going to be a short video because i'm now talking about ending it. i could call it the four minute morning that's what i used to have name it before that it was the two and a half minute warning and whatever i feel as long of a video i want to make sometimes they're long and really long and like this one sometimes they're short i'll talk to you later on and have yourself a great day Bye bye